Hey everybody, Alerby Gaming here bringing you another video for Call of Duty Modern Warfare. We are doing the top best weapons, S tier weapons in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 right now. These are not just my opinion, these are actually weapons that are on the Modern Warfare 2 website. It tells you what is the best weapons, S tier, A tier, the meta tier, and then weapons that might be used in the esports tournaments coming up for pro players like FaZe, Optic, and so on. So let's go ahead and get into these weapons. I think we have two ARs, we have two SMGs, a LMG, sniper, and a battle rifle to look over. So let's go ahead and look at these real quick. Alright guys, our first AR weapon is the TAQ-56. This is a very good weapon for um, warfare. And um, it's really easy to burst fire it and everything like that. I'm not really going to go into rounds. It's going to take like forever for me to make this video and give you guys content. Let's talk about it for a little bit. So the TAQ is a solid rifle for uh, to kill time. TK, in other words... It's like the lowest recoil in its class, I believe it says. Um, this is like pro players, I think, uh, slash card using the SMD during like CMG wagers and stuff like that. And this is this all the time. And it's just, like, look how. F the recoil is like insane. There is no recoil, you know. It's like, look at this. This is no attachment, by the way. I'm just seriously shooting this gun with no attachment. So, that is the number fifth gun it's the s tier gun is the scar l or the taq 56 um a lot of people use this because of the no recoil and the fast kill time kill somebody else. so anyway let's go to the next weapon next weapon is the kozov 762 aka the ak-47 this is another outstanding assault rifle it's um, compared to the TAQ, it's slightly higher recoil though on this weapon, but it has faster to kill time as well. So this is basically the two assault rifles I think will be used in the uh, tournaments for sure. And uh, look at that, from way down there, just a headshot easy. So this or either the TAQ I think will win to the ranked competitive meta by the time 2023 CDL uh, season starts. So, be looking for this weapon, guys. And uh, let's get into weapon number three. Right, guys, the third weapon I picked is the Vel 46. This is one that they put at the A tier, but I put it at the S tier just because I have used this compared to all the other SMGs. And the fire rate is insane. And if you're really good at you can get on a target and just stick there, and it's super duper, um, good. Now, it's horrible at long range, but up close, you won't get any single enemy that has MP5 or anything. So, this is probably one of my favorite SMGs, but there's one more that outranks this. You'll probably already know what it is, and uh, some of y'all might be surprised. So, let's go ahead and get into the number four spot right now. Number four spot, guys, we have the Fennec 45, aka the Victor. This one is seriously the best SMG I think in the game right now. No joke. If you have a big round mag, 30 bullets is not enough for this gun. You have to have like a 60. Because look how like, fast paced it is. It runs out of ammo really quick. But this is probably the, one of the best SMGs besides the Vel 46, in my opinion, for Modern Warfare 2 right now. During the Warzone, these will definitely be like the new. Uh, New weapons for highest ranking SMGs in this game it is the Finnick 45, the Vel 46. These kind of two are tied. By the way, this list is in no particular order. So um, let's go to weapon number five. Number five, we have the Victus. Um, this is a sniper, the first one you unlock. And if you have high velocity and suppressor on it, it's probably the best gun in its class. Um, some people are talking about how the second sniper is the best semi-automatic, but I'm here to tell you that the uh, semi-automatic sniper has so bad recoil. I'm sure it's probably really good with attachments, but this one has like only two attachments on it, and it's uh, it's pretty dang good. So, with that said, that is our fifth sniper rifle, and I'm just trying to talk while I'm playing. It's kind of hard, but anyway, Victus XMR is the uh, fifth best. Sniper, I think, or the fifth best gun. So, let's go ahead and get into number six. The best LMG in the game that Call of Duty says, it is the 
RPK, RPK LMG. So this LMG for some reason it plays the best, it has the fastest kill time, and um, believe it or not, it has a good run of mag. It has I think 75 bullets, which is not as much as I think the first uh, LMG they give you is like 100. But like I said, this has probably like the best kill time. Like I said, right now these guns have no attachments on it at all. So um, I'm just trying to play around with them without any attachments. So. With that said, this is probably the best LMG the game does say um, in Modern Warfare 2. So let's get into the next weapon. You knew this was coming, guys. Coming in at number 7 is the SBR. This is a um, battle rifle, and it's the best one in its class. People say it's like uh, really good for headshots. The iron sights are really good on it, but... Uh, I don't know, what do y'all think? What is all the best weapons in Call of Duty Warfare? This is what it says on the website. That's why I'm bringing it. I haven't really used it that much. I'm sure it's probably better than not. Um, I've seen people use this with a scope, and it's actually one of the best guns. It's really easy to just keep shooting people. Now, these are double, so no matter what, headshots these guys are normally too. But uh, this is the end of the video, guys. Thank you for watching. This is the last weapon. It's number seven, SPR 500. Number six was the RPK, and so on. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. Let me know what you all think of these weapons in Modern Warfare 2 so far. A lot of people are probably going to be leaning toward the Lockman, which is the next MP5. Or the, um, I think another weapon really good is actually the AK-47U. But I already put like two assault rifles on here, so I don't want to put like three of them on here. I want to get like a balanced uh, rating. So uh, thank you for watching, and LRB Gaming, and peace out.